Hey guys, it's Mr. B here again. Thank you for checking out my video today. Today we have a brand new PowerPoint game called Oshi no Ko. It's a very popular animation right now, so I hope you guys enjoy this PowerPoint game. You can grab this free PowerPoint in the description box below this video. And if you're new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so that you can get the latest materials when I put them up on this channel. So let's take a look at this game. All right, this is the Oshinoko PowerPoint game. On the right side here, we have the how to play button, the start game button, and the support more projects button. If you guys want to support more projects like these, you can help out the channel by clicking here and visiting the page uh, to help out this channel. All right, so let's click on the how to play game here. And this will take us to the page that explains the rules. You can play this uh, in a group of four, um, or you can play this one-on-one -on -one, um, if you're playing this online. And you can choose different colors. There's four colors to choose. Um, you click on the stars to go to a QA slide. Then you click on the microphone um, on the QA slide to reveal the answer. And if the students can get the answer correctly. You click on the headphone here and they can get some points. And if they answer wrong, just click on the little arrow here and they'll just take back, take them back to the main, um, main screen. And you can click on the add point button for your team or the minus button to reduce the points. And the team with the best rating wins or whoever gets the most point wins. And I'll show you how to edit the game as well later. So I hope you can watch this video until the end to learn how to do that. All right, now we're back here. We'll go to start game. And this will take us to the main game board. So here is the main game board. We have the stars up here for the students to uh, select or choose. And we have four teams down here. We have team one, yellow, team two, blue, team three, green, and team four, red. And next to um, here, we have the plus. And here, plus, when you click on this, it will add the points. And this is minus to reduce the points. So that's how that works. All right, so let's take a look at this game and see how it works. So the students can randomly uh, pick a star here. So let's say they pick number four here. So we'll click on that and that will take us to the QA slide. Here you can edit the question and add a picture here later. And if you click on the microphone here in the upper right corner, that'll bring up the answer. So let's go ahead and do that. And here you can edit the answer. And on the left here, if they get it wrong, it'll just take them back to the main game board and they'll get 80 points. And here is the headphone. If you click on that, it'll take you to the reward slide. So here we get one golden microphone. So that's one point for this team. If it's the red team, uh, they get one point. Click on the return button. And here is a bonus. So they also get a bonus as well. All right, great performance. So they get plus two more points. Click on the return button here. So they got uh, one point plus two more. All right, let's try it for uh, team blue this time. Let's just select a random letter here. So here again, you get to change the question. Click on the microphone here to bring up the answer. This is to go back and this is to go to the next slide for some rewards. All right, so this team gets two golden microphone points. So let's get the turn button here. And, oh, we got another bonus. This is a rock, scissors, paper game. And this is the rules here, how to play it. So uh, we click on the microphone here. So the students have to do rock, scissors, paper first, so they can't cheat. So they have to show the hands first. So have them do rock, scissors, paper. And then you click on I here. So click on this microphone. And the winner gets two points. And if they lose, they get minus two points. <laughs> 
So let's click on the microphone to get rid of this. And let's click on I here. And we click on her again to stop. So if they got paper, they won. Let's keep, try it again. So this time I'm going to go for uh, scissors. Let's see if I can win. And click on her again to stop. Nope, we got a tie, so we get no points. So let's click on return here and let's just give them whatever. That's a point since they won. Let's give them two points. Two points whatever you want. And let's click on here. D, let's try D this time. Again, question up here. Click on the microphone to bring up the correct answer. Click on the headphones here. And this team gets one point. And let's click return. And there's also a bonus. This is a, a wheel game. The rule is click on the center of the wheel to spin. And click on the center of the wheel again to stop. Minus or plus points where the arrow points. So let's click on the center of the wheel here and click on it again to stop. So this is minus one point. And you can try it again. And stop. And this is my all team minus two. So we go minus two here and minus two here. All right, so you play with this game however way you want, and you can use whatever language you want. It's really, it's really up to you. Um, you can use this um, online, or if you are you are parents, you can play this with your children as well. All right, so this team gets one point. All right, so they got a great performance, so plus two more points for uh, this team. So let's say the green team got that, or the red team. All right, let's just try another one. All right, let's see what happens when you click here. This team gets one point, and you hit return. There's a bonus this time, so we have left, middle, and right, so they can select left, middle, or right. Let's choose the left here. All right, another great performance, plus two points for this team as well. Hope you guys are enjoying my PowerPoint games and materials. And if you do, don't forget to like, share, and comment. It will really help out this channel a lot. So let's see, for this one, we get uh, only one point here. And hit return if you get, see if we get some bonus. Oh, we got a different type of bonus here. We got um, top, middle, and right. So they can choose from the top, middle, or the right. We got Ruby, I, and Aqua. So let's choose I here and we get two points for this team. All right, let's try this one. Oh, we have Aqua this time. Let's click on this one right here. And another Rocks vs. Paper game. You click on I here to start the game. And click on her again to stop the game. All right. Let's just try a few more here. Let's try T this time. And let's see, what do we get this time? Yeah! Right, let's click on the return here, and we get another one here. We got Ruby, I, and Aqua here. So let's click on Aqua. And we get plus three this time. Awesome. All right. We got Akane here. Let's see. Let's click on the headphone. See uh, what we get for points. Oh, got a bonus. Let's try the middle this time. <laughs> Great performance. Steal three points from any team. So you can steal any points. Uh, three points from any team. So let's take... Um, Let's add, uh, let's see, let's go with this one. We'll add three points here and we'll reduce three points from this team. 
All right, cool, cool. All right, so as you can see, if you click on here, the plus, once the team reaches the end, they win, or whoever gets the most point wins. So whoever gets the best rating wins. All right, so here we have um, the background. You can click on the background here to start and stop the background. The video will play automatically, but you can also stop it by clicking on the background, anywhere on the background to stop it. So let's take a look at how we can edit one of the QA slides. So I'll go to uh, slide number three here. Click on that and we'll go to question here. I'll we'll click here, double click, highlight everything, and we'll just write a question here. So let's see, uh, we can write in, um, when do you study English? All right, and let's put an answer down here. Um, see, I, uh, I study English on, all right, and then we can add an image here by clicking here, right click, go to change picture and choose from a file here. And then we can go to our, uh, picture folder and browse for a picture to insert. Uh, let's see, I want something uh, maybe English related. Uh, maybe this one, this one will do. We'll insert that. And there we have it. We have our uh, Q&A plus picture. Now we can take a look at it again. Let's go to slide number two, hit play. And that was, um, I believe that was A. So let's click on A to see what that looks like. All right, let's click here. When you study English, let's click on the microphone to reveal the answer. And if they get it right, we can click on the headphone. Super. So this team gets four points. Hit the return button to go back to the main game board and give them four points. All right. Awesome. Now, if the volume is too low, just zoom out on slide two and you'll find the boom box here and you can adjust the volume. You can raise it or lower it to make it uh, louder or higher. I usually put it low when I uh, teach online because it's really hard to ad adjust it once I start the game. So I usually put the volume low. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it for this game. If you enjoy my PowerPoint games and materials, please don't forget to like, share, and comment. It will really help out this channel. And I also want to wish and thank all of the viewers and supporters who have helped uh, this channel. Without you guys, this wouldn't be possible. So thank you. Also, if you have any ideas or recommendations, please don't hesitate to write them down below in the comment section so I can take a look at that. If you want to see more materials like this and you want to uh, be updated, please don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so that you can get the latest materials when I uh, put them up on this channel. Again, I want to thank each and every one of you, and I want to wish you the best of luck in your classes.